How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here and today is the start of the Brawlhalla Valhalla Times 2022 event. Very, very exciting. So if this is your first time, welcome. <laughs> we have two new skins in the Valhalla Times event for 2022. We have Celestis Yumiko. Very, very cool. I like the bow a lot. And then we also have a brand new skin for Vector of all legends. I guess robots can love too. And I, I do like the Cupid's Arrow Lance right there. Those are the only two new, new, new things other than the podium, which we will get to in a second. But we got the KO X, or sorry, <laughs> XO KO effect. Definitely have this one equipped because it's cute. And then we also have the podium. This is what the new podium looks like. Basically some dolphins on there. I do have the podiums from previous years and I will show you those podiums in a second. Uh, the item skin is the Cupid's bow right here. This is a really cool bow that I like to use from time to time as well. And then uh, what else we got? We got the avatar, which I already have equipped the animated one, but they also have the chocolate bared bar if you want to get that one instead. And then the colors. So the only two, I already got them, uh, but the only two colors that I did not have were for Reno and Moonin. And as you can see, I got Moonin right there, and I also got Reno. So now I have Love Struck with every legend in the game. If you like these colors, definitely get them now because you're not going to be able to get them once the event is over until next year. So, And then as far as the skins go, guys, other than the two brand new skins, we have quite a few of skins that have been previously released. So we have Red Rose Kaya. We got Date Night Dusk. We got Chalk Core Lot. Look at that hammer. One of my favorite hammers in the game. We got Red Romance Volkov. Lovelace Ada. Secret Admirer Zariel. Heartbreaker Baraza. We have so many of these skins that have come out in previous uh, years. Usually they come out with like two skins a year. So you can do the math and figure out how long they've been doing this event. But it's been quite a long time. And we are going to use every single one of these skins in an actual game in this video so don't go anywhere that's all of them that's all of them but we're actually not just gonna show them we're gonna play and the only way i can show 15 different skins in one video is if we do strike out so we can do three at a time so you might be interested in what the previous uh podiums looked like this is the 2021 this is i think the first one that they did and then i also have 20 no wait 2021 had like a owl wing or something like that. It's kind of hard to see actually. Uh, but yeah, there's like an owl or something with the wing sticking out. And then now we have 2022 with the dolphins. All right. So first game, I, I usually start with the newest skins first, but this time I kind of want to do them last. We're going to go with the oldest, the original Valhalla and Tyne skins first and work our way all the way to the newest ones at the end, okay? So we're gonna go Queen Nye. She was the very first Valhalla and Tyne skin. Then we have Classy Sir Roland. This is one of my favorites as well because of the rose in his mouth. It looks cool. And then we have Eternal Love Brin. This is also one of my favorites. I remember when I first was getting into Brawlhalla and I really wanted this skin. And um, oh, we're gonna go Love Struck colors for sure. And I didn't get the skin, like I accidentally didn't get it. I didn't realize the event ended when it did. And I had to wait a whole nother year before I could get that skin. And the, one of the reasons I really wanted the Eternal Love Brin is because I had every other Brin skin except that skin. And back then I was basically a Brin main, so I really wanted every skin for Brin. But yeah, I had to wait a whole year. So don't be like me. If you really want one of these skins, just get it. If you don't like it, you can always refund it. All right, we're going against Larry Kapchija. Let's go through every single Valhalla Tine skin, baby. I'm going to make sure to use all three of these every single fight. Win or lose. I'm not really focused too hard on winning, but we're going to try to win. The important thing is just showing you guys a little bit of each of these skins. They don't have any different signature graphics, unfortunately, but they still look really good. It would be cool if they shot like hearts or something. All right. Well, that was that was date night nigh. She looks really cute, but that's it for her. We're going to go to the next skin because we got a lot of skins to show off. And you saw the XOKO effect, which is very cool. Classy Sir Roland. Look at these. 
these colors and in fact classy sir roland looks good in a lot of different colors i can vouch because i use sir roland quite a bit i'm not like a lance player per se i don't consider myself one but i do like playing with sir roland bye bye all right well that was classy sir roland hope you guys enjoyed he's got a pink little flower in his mouth and now it is time for eternal love brin did you see the little cupids had brin's head on okay that was weird i thought he might dodge in but no oh goodbye taros no no <laughs> Well, I guess when I said goodbye, I was the one that was leaving, not him. <laughs> that was Eternal Love Break, guys. Hope you enjoyed. He gave a face fall. He's like, what were you doing, bro? You killed yourself twice. Actually, all three times. <laughs> Moving along. So the fourth skin was Heart of Hathor Mirage. The next was Demon Bride Hattori. This one I really like, too. I really like her sword. I don't know why, but it's just very like easy to recognize, I guess. Then we have Suter Lucian right here. Boom, he's got a really, really fashionable looking hat. I think I'm gonna use these colors because look at that. It puts his hat nice white and then the heart is red. Very, very good colors right there for Valentine's Day. I would use the love struck colors every single time, but you know, I figured you guys would probably get bored of that. Plus, we want to see other colors, you know what I mean? We want to see what these skins look like in other colors. I've, as you can see, Code of Lions looks good on any of these Valhallentine skins. All right, here we go. We're going to try to go through all three of these legends. Win or lose, doesn't really matter. Ooh, we dancing, we dancing. <laughs> Everybody uses the throne emote. All right, let's get some Mirage gameplay. Oh, got that neutral sig. Let's go. Oh, he countered beautifully there. Bro, how did that hit me when I was so close? I don't know. Don't be going for that weapon so obviously, Jiro. It's going to get you killed. All right. This was Heart of Hathor Mirage. Hope you guys enjoyed your stay. Bye-bye. And you can see who's next on the Cupid's. <laughs> we have Hattori. This is one of my favorite ones. It actually is. I know I say that on a lot of them, but this one really is. I love this one. If you guys have seen that movie, The Ring, this one looks just like the girl in The Ring. All right, well, bye-bye, Munin. I always think I say the name wrong. Munin or Moonin. I always want to say Munin. All right, thank you, Hattori for your services, but now we have Lucian. And I do love me some Katars. Oops, didn't mean to do that, but she didn't punish, so it's all good. This one is a really fun skin. I mean, you don't see too many people using these skins, but I'm sure you will now because the event is live. You know what I mean? All right. We got we to gotta take care of business here. We're not going to lose like we did the last game, right? All right. Let's focus. Bye-bye. You did. Oh, I didn't get that touch. Boom. Okay. Oh, you know what, guys? I didn't even realize. But today we have new Battle Pass missions as well. There you go, look at that. I'm actually getting a lot of progress on them without even trying. Feels good. All right, well, we went through all three of those skins, guys, and we are only like halfway. So the next skin in order from that they were released, Heartbreaker Baraza. Then we have Lovelace Ada. Boom, this one, not my favorite. I don't know why, it just, not my favorite. And then, oh, this one, I really do like this one, where is it? Is Zari Where is Zariel? There he is. Secret Admirer Zariel. This one I really do like. Ooh, Esports version 2 looks good on them. We already did Code of Lions. Mm. Ooh, Gala Colors looks good. I think I want to do Esports version 2 on this group. 
Only because it looks good on Zariel. I don't know how it's going to look on the other legends, but I guess we're going to find out. Oh yeah, it looks good. It still looks good on Barraza. If you guys didn't see my video yesterday, I did Barraza in ranked 1v1. And it was a pretty good uh, pretty good video, if I say so myself. I did pretty good with Barraza. I, I don't really play Barraza too much, but you don't have to. He's a really, really good legend. High defense, blasters, and axe. Really good signatures. Oh yeah, these colors look amazing on this skin. Bro, this guy is crazy. The only thing about Barraza I didn't like that much when I was playing him in ranked was that he swings so slow, you know? Like, don't miss or you're gonna get punished hard, basically. All right, let's try the blasters. We've been doing pretty good with the axe, but I like to use both weapons, you know what I mean? No! Barraza, not like this! Okay, well that's fine. We needed to go to the next legend anyway. I definitely played better than that in the uh, ranked 1v1 video. Just <laughs> That was so bad. Oh, man. Oops, not what I was trying to do. Not Whoa, where are you going there? We Oh my. We gotta be careful. This guy's gonna destroy all of our guys. Lovely Seda. I know I said I didn't like this game, but now that I'm actually playing with it, it's not too bad. I don't mind it. Maybe it's just the colors. I don't mind playing Ada at all. Like, I like playing as Ada. Hold that. Oops. Oh! What a down sick. Yo, this guy is actually making it a good fight. I will say that. Oh, don't hit me with that neutral sig. Don't do it. I'm so scared of uh, Reno's neutral sig on blasters. There it is. Ooh, sniped with that spear. The spear does look pretty cool. All right, thank you, Ada. Now we are on to Secret Admirer Zario. Let's go. Bean soup. Oh, that was so close, Bean soup. Shouldn't have thrown your weapon away. Shouldn't have thrown it, Bean. You are gonna be toast. Boom! Slam dunk off the bottom of the stage. That should have been an achievement. He literally touched the inside middle. That was crazy. GG, dude. GG. At least, you know, we, we lost with Barraza kind of bad. But, you know, we brought it right back and got the win. That's, not, that's what's up. All right. We are over halfway done now, I think. All right. So, we got Secret Admirer Volkov. Or, no, no. <laughs> It's Red Robans Volkov. Sorry, uh, Zario. <laughs> I got a mixed up. <laughs> and then we have Chakor Lot. This is one of my favorite ones, guys. Core has some of the best skins. Look at that. He just does. Core has some of the best skins, man. Anyways, Chakor Lot with the uh, Sucker Punch Hammer, of course. And then we have Date Night Dusk. All right. Date Night Dusk. This is not one of my favorites, but at the same time, I don't really like hardly any of Dust skins except for the Thornwood one, but that's just me. Uh, which color are we going to be using? I'm not sure. I'm trying to look at which one makes his glasses really stand out. Community colors doesn't look terrible. Frozen Forest as well. Soulfire. Oh my gosh. I can't choose. Maybe I'll just hit random and see what I get. And boom. Pink. No, we're not doing pink. All right. Soulfire it is. We're doing Soulfire colors. Actually, it looks good on Volkov, so. And here we go. Going against Anthony 66A7X. That sounds like a, a model of like an airplane or something. <laughs> All right, here we go. I like the skin that they're using on Nyx. 
Really? Really, bro? I let you get the weapon? That's how you repay me? You think I'm scared? You think- Oh, 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 oh. I could probably beat him unarmed, but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna beat him with Volkov. Actually, you know what I do need? The reversal sigs on Volkov. Not even close. Bye-bye. That's why you don't punch me when I'm giving you the weapon and opening talk. Uh-oh. Actually, we're done with Volkov. I don't even need to play Volkov anymore. Bye-bye. All right. Now we're moving on to Chalkor Lot. Oh, this skin looks kind of, uh, kind of, I don't know what the word is in these colors. You know what I'm saying? Baby, I do love playing core. Core is super fun. Ow, that one hurt. Oh, 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 we get out of here, Bordex. Get out of here. You guys didn't even get to see the hammer, but look at that. I love this hammer. It is beautiful. Bro, why are you trying to hit me so bad with that? Oh, I forgot. We need to go to the next legend. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, goodbye. We're going to the next legend. I forget who it is. Oh, yeah. Date Night Dusk. Let's go. Date Night Dusk. Way too early on the release. Come on. That bread. Thank you. Ooh, got her with the side seek. Date night does. Looking classy. Uh, GG Antony 66A7X. And now we are on to the final three, which includes the two new skins Matchmaker Vector and Celestis Yumiko. But first we have Red Rose Kaya. I actually really like that one. It looks good on her. And then we have Matchmaker Vector. Where is it? There we go. Oh man, the Cupid's Arrow looks really nice. And then we have Celestis Yumiko. I'm not really sure which color to use. Coat of Lions looks really good. I think I want to use, hmm. Charged OG isn't too bad. Maybe I'll use Charged OG, why not? So far we won every game, I think. Uh, did we win our first match? I don't remember. Like I said, it doesn't really matter. I'm not really trying to win or lose, I'm just, Trying to show you guys these beautiful skins so that you can decide for yourself if you want to buy them or not, you know? All right, we're going against Kamas. And let's get it going, baby. Red Rose Kaya. I kind of wish they would add an emote for like the events, you know what I mean? Oh yeah, core. I'm gonna get you unarmed if I must. Oh. Oh.
Let's go. We still got this. Red Rose Kaya. Ooh, got him with the mammoth. Let's go. I didn't even get to use the bow. You know what? I also should have used Cupid's bow for at least one skin. I didn't think of that. All right, well, we got Vector. Wow, he looks crazy in these colors. Man, I gave him a free stock and he don't even want to give me a, a, a weapon. That's okay. Ooh, get out of here with that vector. Oh, goodbye. Oh, <laughs> goodbye, Brax. I don't know if I like this skin in these colors. They're kind of crazy. All right, bye-bye. Last but not least, guys, we have Celestis Yumiko. I hope I'm not saying that wrong, but yeah, there we go. Let's use the hammer. Oh yeah, that's game, that's game. Maybe we can finish it off with a Russian Mafia. Oh, well, he fell off the edge, otherwise we probably could have. GG dude, GG, well played. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like. It really helps out the channel. Be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content because I'm always putting it out there. And yeah, let me know which of the skins and which event is your favorite. Out of all of the Valhalla Time skins, I think my favorite mm, is either Chalk or Lot. Uh, Secret Admirer Zariel is good. Eternal of Bryn, of course. There's so many. I can't choose one. Let me know which is your favorite in the comments below. And as always, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.